Okay, I think we have a question right there from uh, Lance Kogmeyer from the LA Times. Mikey, congratulations. Um, despite, how does it lend itself to a, a possible move up to welterweight against Spence? What, what did you take from tonight that pro really proves that point? You know? Oh, well, I always look for the biggest challenges. I'm looking for the biggest fights. You know, ever since I came back, I wanted to, in a way, make up for the last time. And I don't think there's any other way except fighting the best champions out there. We fought another undefeated fighter, undefeated champion tonight. There's no one else that excites me enough, that motivates me, and that can challenge me other than Errol Spence. And I'm willing to take that challenge all the way up just because that's the fight that I want. That's the fight that will motivate me the most. Hey, Mikey, back here. Mikey, straight back. Bad, great feeling. Hey, congratulations on the win tonight. Um, when you talk about Errol Spence, he came over and spoke to some of us at ringside after the fight, and uh, we asked him what he thought about it. And when he was concluding his remarks, he said he was licking his chops. Uh, you know, he gave you respect for being a, a, a top-notch fighter, but it seemed like he didn't think that, that your size would translate to where he's at. Um, what do you think about the fact that you're both tremendous fighters, but that he's so much bigger than you. No, that's uh, that's a challenge. You know, I am moving up all the way to welterweight. You know, if I land that fight, it'll be my first attempt at, at welterweight, and I'm going against the top guy there, against the, the best in the division. I'm prepared to take on that challenge. Like I said, I'm here to challenge myself, you know, and he is the best. He might feel that it's, you know, an easy fight for him when I'm too small. No, well, that's that's fine. You know, let's let's get in the ring and let's get to work. I'd like to ask Robert Garcia about that also. Robert, I, I know that you've had uh, in past statements had some misgivings about the prospect of Mikey going up to welterweight. Can you expound on that now that it seems though it's going to probably become a reality at the end of this year? Look, we've always uh, said that uh, we shouldn't move too fast and, and, and take that challenge right now because you know, we're doing great at. Uh, I like with and even Junior uh, Watch with, but uh, that's what Mikey wants. So, uh, we know that uh, he does have the skills, he has, he has the time to compete. You know, it's not going to be easy, and uh, Mikey said before, you know, he, he, got, you know, he, he loves his challenges, and uh, this will probably be the, the first fight that he's ever had where he's going to be the underdog, and I think that's what's going to motivate him even more. That's why he wants to take So, I'm, 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 you know, from now on, we're, we're, we're going to take the fight. Just give it up for Robert Easter, he's leaving. Oh,